Good evening, everyone. Welcome back to Utah Spiritual Cocktail Videos. My name is Charles, and tonight's cocktail is called the Hale Kalani. I'm just going to screw that up. Hale Kalani. Got it that time. And it's featuring Hammer Spring Distillers Bourbon. We're going to have a little bit of extra bitters, a little bit of orange juice, a little bit of lemon juice, and some grenadine. So let's get started. So first off, we're going to use an ounce and a half of Hammer Spring Hammer Spring makes a fantastic bourbon, by the way. Ah, while we're talking about Hammer Spring distillers and their bourbon, they are on page eight of Utah Spirit Show Guy. You take a two French. That's for free. Whatever you want to call. Super cool distillery to go visit. Simplicity Cocktails is right around the corner from them. Literally, they're in the same building. It's just like right around the parking lot. But JP at Hammer Spring has created a great aesthetic in his front area, and it's really neat to go visit. He's also got some pretty cool stuff for sale as well. Next, we're going to get the grenadine, which is half an ounce. Now we're gonna get a half an ounce of lemon juice. Now I've cut this in half and then because of this juicer, it's got a round end, right? Well, lemons have point. So I cut the tip off, just the tip. Good, half an ounce. And now it's time for the Juicematic 9000. Oh, yeah. I feel like monks should be singing every time I come to this thing. Out. So we obviously we cut our orange, right? And we need a glass. To catch the juice in. So you can see the action. It's an amazing machine. First time I used it, I put the arm right into that glass. Again, I kind of overbought probably on this juicer, but it's so cool and so efficient. Okay, we'll just put this to the side while it's dripping. And I'm going to use this to catch that juice. What do you know? Half an ounce. I'm going to add some ice, shake it up, pour it into a glass. We didn't add bitters. One dash of bitters would have made a big difference, but just follow the recipe. So I add two because these tips don't put out as much as they would in a normal bitters bottle, but they're cooler. So now let's shake.
I'm just gonna grab our Hawthorn strainer. Strain into our cocktail glass. smell the hammer spring bourbon. It's coming out of it. It's really nice. And for a garnish, we're gonna use a dried orange wheel. I got these orange wheels at Den and Brick, by the way. They've always got cool stuff in there. For making cocktails. I'm just going to put it on there. I like that. And there you go. Hala Kalani. So twice now. Let's give it a shot, shall we? Ooh, I definitely smell that bourbon coming through. So good. Ooh, that is wow so great so admittedly i am a diehard bourbon fan and that is especially good it just accents the bourbons so nicely the orange juice and the lemon juice the grenadine bitters all just sing in this cocktail it's fantastic so good Oh yeah. Yeah, if you're if you're a bourbon head, and I know you're out there, this may be your next cocktail. It's truly spectacular. You may even want to play around with the bitters. Like a dark chocolate bitter would be really nice in this cocktail too. Um yeah, I mean it's just it's just a solid cocktail. So good. I hope you enjoyed the cocktail video tonight, the Hala Kalani. And here's to hoping this evening found you in good spirits with good spirits. Cheers. Oh, yeah, that's good. Really good. Thanks again for watching.